are welcome, friends, generals, noobs, and pros to Command and Conquer Generals Zero Hour Game Replays Extravaganza Gold Cup Semi Final Mr. Vivid versus Mr. Fargo. Most excellent setup, explosive action, and players to be expected very, very soon. Yeah, this match it did happen today. They already played. It was meant to be live streamed by Mr. Dominator at the 13 GMT on this very Friday. But apparently there was a little bit of a latency in the match as usual. Yeah, when the Vivid is involved, there is a little bit of lag. Yeah, because Vivid very far away in Malaysia. Where is Malaysia? Very far away. And the Fargo from Lithuania. I think he lives in uh, Great Britain, London. I think so. Yeah, so a very far distance, and if you add streamer on top of it, then you have a little bit of latency. Yeah, <laughs> so uh, whenever the Vivid is involved, yeah, it's very difficult to get a high performance game. But Vivid is all about the high performance gaming when it is the one versus one. Yeah, uh, very good to gaming. Both players reach the semi final. Let's take a look at the tournament grid. Yeah, here, Gold Cup. I think there has been no live stream of this uh, match yet and also the replays were not posted in the forum so no one knows the result. Stanislav does not know the result as well. I think the chat is safe to use. No one knows anything. Yeah, it's a well kept secret. Vivid versus Fargo. Maybe, maybe the Vivid and the Fargo are in the chat. Yeah, so you won't get to see any flaming, any conversations in the... <laughs> while we watch the replays. But maybe you get to flame or you get flamed by the Fargo in the chat or by the Vivid. Yeah, maybe the Fargo is well known here for all this flaming. Maybe we get a taste in the chat. Yeah, keep an eye for the Fargo or the Vivid. Okay, so let's take a look at, at the performance here. Mr. Vivid, yeah, he defeated the Boyka with a 7-5. Very professional. Wow, Vivid. Epic, epic fight here. We did see it. Yeah, against the Boyka. Very professional. Uh, last year, Vivid was knocked out by Boyka in the uh, World Series semi-final with 7-6, uh, I believe. Yeah, 7-6. But this time, he knocked out the Boyka and the Fargo very confident. 7-3 against the Scuba. No chance. No chance. Fargo by far the best lead here from all the quarter finalists in the Gold Cup. Yeah, and here the other semi-final is Big Size versus Sir Exka. Yeah, this one will be played on Monday. Monday. Let's take a look. Yeah, here. Monday 1930 GMT. Size versus Exka live by Antipro. Mr. Antipro. Yeah, you go on the stream box. Link is below this video in the description. And then you click here on the Antipro. Let's do it. Yeah, there you see. Oh, see, there are some people. Oh, no, let's type in here. Plus, plus, plus. Size. X guy. <laughs> okay, yeah. So this will be on Monday. Uh, if you if you miss it on Monday, you can also watch it on Tuesday. Uh, Stanislav will stream on Tuesday. Same time as always. 20 GMT. The replays of Size versus X guy as well. But live will be on Monday by the Anti Pro, And then the replays one day later on Tuesday. By the Stone Islam. Yeah. And what else do we have here? Uh, Mr. Roll versus Herb. They played two hours ago. Streamer SPL. Uh, we will stream this tomorrow. The replays as well. Same time, Stone Islam TV 20 GMT. Roll versus Herb. Silver Cup semi final as well. And uh, what else do we have here? Ah, yeah. It's still sit here. It's still sit here. Yeah. So tomorrow you can also watch the Silver Cup here if you want to. Otherwise, you can also go to the SPL, a Russian streamer, and watch it there if you want to. Okay, that's about the schedule. Yeah, enough talking. You want to see the action, right? You want to see the action. Let's go here to... to ah, here the game. Yeah, the replays are already uh, prepared by Mr. Nickname. And let's... No, wait. First, we need to open the scoreboard, of course. Scoreboard. There it is. Ah. Okay, Vivid from Malaysia. Let's type it in. Malay... Uh, Malaysia... And the Fargo from Lithuania. Welcome. Okay. 
It's the best of a 13. I think the title is wrong here. It says silver cup. Oh, no, this is a gold cup. Not some lousy silver cup. <laughs> it's a big cash. Okay, gold. Is that correct? Gold cup, best of 13. Yeah, that is correct. Okay. Yeah, I wonder if the Fargo or the Vivid are here in the jet. Give them a good hand. Or the flame, if you want to. <laughs> okay, so... That is match number one on the Vendetta. Let's go. Yeah, the replays were provided by the Fargo and the Vivid during the day. So it should be hot. Yeah, very hot here. Vivid with the OE Clan Tech and Easy Fargo. Let's lock it in. Fargo with the blue color. Vivid with the green. And it's the Air Force Mirror, the first match here in the set. Okay, Mr. Vivid down here, green color. Fargo up there. Blue color. Both are Air Force. Two oil directs here on this map. Of course, we have seen this matchup <laughs> all the time already. There were some epic fights, but also quite some outages. Yeah, I, may, I may remember you of the Kassad versus... Uh, who was it? Kassad versus Aces. Yeah, Kassad versus Aces was pure domination of an Air Force mirror. Unbelievable domination. Still took the Kassad quite a while to kill the Aces, but... By the time Kassad was 5 star, I think Aces was still just 2 star. It was quite some carnage. But Aces was a survivor. Give him credit for this. But looks like Air Force was not really his strength. Let's see what the Vivid and the Fargo can do here in this match. Fargo with a fast drop. And the Vivid as well. Our fast laser lock. Well done there. We'll kill this dozer. Also fast laser lock here. But Fargo is quick. To pull away his chinos. Oh, the dozer is coming here. Very confident for the crush. Oh, maybe he's successful. Yes! Kills one. Oh, then he stops moving. Fargo had enough. Just wanted to kill one. Not more. Okay. Fargo also stealing some cash here. Still has his rocket soldiers here. And the vivid, very ambitious with his barracks. <laughs> yeah, why not? Why not? But loses his dozer. Okay. Kill the Chinook here. With the King Raptor. No, with the Rocket Soldiers. Okay, right now Vivid has no airfield. Just his barracks here for the aggression. Fargo. Fargo looks like in a good position here. Yeah, he has the airfield. If he can defend against this, should be good. Oh, we'll lose his Doza here. PDL was not perfect. Not so much happening here. Actually, Vivid does have a lot of troops here in the base of the Fargo. Should be able to kill all their planes. Well done there. Yeah, the Rangers. They can kill the Raptors here. Uh, maybe not now. Well done. Okay, so Vivid finally builds his first airfield. Three minutes into the match. He did not kill much yet. Apart from a Raptor. And a Dozer. Fargo already has three Raptors. Certainly Fargo is ahead. Ah, he's in a very comfortable position. Maybe he can go and kill the airfield or the supply. Ah, he takes his time. Looks like he wants to kill nothing. Not sure if that's the right choice. I think killing something is always better than killing nothing. Yeah, now he killed the Dozer and two Chinooks. Well done here by the Fargo. Powerful aggression. Okay, meantime also swamps a couple of uh, Rangers to capture the oils. Good for him. Vivid does have the capture upgrade. Fargo does as well. He can capture. He can capture the oils now. Uh, there's enough guys there. Should be able to succeed. Vivid has two airfields. No King Raptors yet. Actually, there's one in the air. But it kills nothing. The 
Those are coming for the crash, but Fargo is quick to intercept. Ah, these are oil derricks are in very high demand here for the Air Force because it's good to have. Gives boost, uh, cash boost, and it takes one attack to kill. So certainly makes sense to capture if you can. Okay, another Chinook was killed here. Fargo in a very excellent position. There is a GG. Vivid 0, Fargo 1. Yeah, that was a very confident performance by the Fargo. Well done there. I wonder if he typed easy at the end of the match. Maybe he did. Okay, that was match number one. Now, I know it will be Demolition Bureau, so we will put the g -Line music. Uh, Alright, match number two. We go quick here. By the way, let's double check that everything is okay here. Yeah, looks like so. All good. Okay, now Vivid on the top with uh, Demolition. Let's lock it in. And the Fargo at the bottom with the demolition as well, blue color. Ah, beautiful. Yeah, this map is quite small. Just these two oil derricks here on the flanks by the choke points. And a bunch of supply piles in the center. Yeah. Fargo with the lead. Vivid needs to catch up. Yeah, certainly both players want to get to the final because in the final the big cash is awaiting from aka Bologna. All his finest drug money up for grabs. First place 800 US dollars. Second place 400 400 US dollars. Yeah, and I think third place 200 US dollars. Yeah, so certainly it absolutely makes sense to get to the final because if you get just to the to the third place match you can't get all that much uh, 200 dollars is not too shabby but of course you want maximum cash uh, 800 dollars the best you can get and of course vivid and fargo want to get there and it's not just the money it's also the pride yeah uh, you want to win big titles extravaganza certainly very big title big cash equals big ownage and big pride. Okay, now Mr. Fargo coming with a technical, and so does a vivid. Couple of terrorists inside. Probably blowing up here. Yeah. yeah. Oh yeah, looks very ambitious. Will kill. Oh, does not kill it completely. Meantime, the terrorist. Oh, just one terrorist inside. No, there's more. There's more. Oh, well done here by the Vivid. Wow, kills the entire arms dealer and the fake barracks. I think the attack was much better here for the Vivid. But it's a wait here for the rebuild. And maybe repair this arms dealer. Oh, nice tunnel network here by the Vivid, deep in the base of the Fargo. Oh, may lose some technical. No, did save very well. And there is another GG. Very quick, under three minutes. Vivid, one, Fargo, one. Oh, that was, that was quite a quick match. Looks like they want to make it quick here. Looks like they had other plans during the day. No long matches. Just easy, quick bashes. <laughs> okay, that was match number two. I hope you're not too disappointed. Maybe you want to see some long action, you know, like 10 minute games. But under three minutes, I have to say, it's quite short. But okay, it is what it is. Right? We cannot change this. Okay, now we got Mr. Vivid with a tank. Let's lock it in. Tank in general, where is it? There. And Air Force, Fargo with Air Force. Okay, this is a nice matchup. And I think this calls for different music. Oh, let's go for the China music here in celebration of the tank. 
Yeah, the tank needs all the support you can get here. Gets dangerous. General Granger, I of course is very very strong. The most powerful general in the game. <laughs> no one messes with General Granger. <laughs> but maybe, maybe the Vivid has some good uh, spam, good tactics, strong Gatling tanks. Maybe, maybe he can knock out the Fargo with some superior spam. Uh, Fargo looks like he goes here for too fast zombies. Only zombies. Yeah, could be. Uh, that's five rocket soldiers in the first army and is on the move. Oh, vivid in danger already. Yeah, uh, you don't want those lousy Humvees enter your base. They are powerful, deadly. Uh, this one should have no problem to out micro the Gatling tank if the latency is okay. Of course, it would if it was laggy. This build would be very very dangerous. Yeah, uh, if you cannot pull your Humvee away in time. Then you can lose it very very quickly. Yeah, it has very weak armor, but the missile defenders inside are powerful and has good range and has good speed. Uh, God speed. So uh, sir, if you micro the Humvees, well, nothing can stop them. Oh, the those are takes a beating here. May go down. Yeah, easy bash. But okay, I think that's why he sent it there. That was meant as a cannon for them. Okay, now it, it all comes down to the Humvee micro here. If Fargo micro as well, might kill everything. Alright, so far so good. Lost nothing yet. But there is a getting tank in the supply lines. No laser lock here. Uh, we'll get there and maybe kill some Chinooks. We will see. Uh, the lameage is strong here with a Fargo. I think so. While he micros his Humvees, there won't be any chat messages. Oh, loses one Humvee now. Oh, maybe he did chat. Maybe he just wrote easy in the chat by then. And then lost his Humvee. <laughs> maybe that's possible. Yeah, was maybe a little bit too overconfident there. And maybe loses another. Let's lose another. Oh, the Vivid. Plus, 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 plus. Oh, and the Fargo also lost his Chinooks. Bullshit. And he's defeated. Easy Fargo has been defeated. Oh, 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 well, this match was longer than a previous one. Three minutes. Above three minutes. So give them credit for this, but this was bash. Vivid bash the Fargo, safe to say. Oh, oh, oh. Vivid two. And the Fargo one. Ah, you are not joking around, Wizard Humvees. If you make a mistake, you will lose a match. <laughs> and the Fargo did. I wonder if there was like maybe. Maybe the Vivid just traveled from Malaysia to New Zealand for some extra latency. <laughs> Deadly for the Humvees. Okay, that was match number three. Man, we are going quick here. Guys, if you have other plans in the evening, you might have time for this. Yeah? We go fast. Very fast. Okay, now the rematch. Vivid with the Air Force versus Fargo with the tank. Let's uh, see if the Vivid will do a little bit better. Maybe he won't play as risky. Maybe he won't go with the two force armies. Maybe he goes a little bit more safe with the two supplies. Maybe some fire bases here and can grab doors and Humvees and, uh, you know, fire base, uh, uh, Patriot, uh, you know, maybe build a wall of headquarters. No, he does sell his headquarter. Okay. Ah, maybe he wants to build his buildings over here. Yeah, his power is just here. Okay. Yeah, you could also just build a wall of headquarters. Yeah, headquarter here, and here, and here, and then you have this vault of investment 6000. But the thing is, uh, if you put a dozer behind the headquarter, it repairs quick, so it's a very strong fortress. People underestimate how strong the command center actually is. Yeah, it's good defense, very strong. Okay, now. Looks like Vivid also goes for fast production, but not as forward. Yeah, the Vivid is very ambitious. Uh, the Fargo was very ambitious in the previous match. Building his stuff here. But actually, it's not so bad. If you go too fast on the Chambis, it makes sense to build the production here. Because it also means, you know, the units have a quicker way to the enemy base. Yeah? Better access. 
Okay, now the vivid. Two Chinooks. Is Dozer's driving backwards in reverse gear? Very professional. Uh, this Dozer probably will take a beating. But Vivid is not having this. Will return to home base. Actually, I think the Dozer makes sense to park it somewhere to block, uh, you know, some gaps. So you can park it here, for example. Okay, now. First enemy contact here. Getting tank versus Humvee. Humvees are okay. Now let's see if the Vivid can micromanage better than the Fargo. Also, same tactic. Two fast Humvees. Let's see if he can out micro the Fargo. Yeah, if you lose one Humvee, it is still possible to win. But if you lose both, then it's very, very hard to come back. Yeah. I think if Vivid beats us 3 minutes 16 seconds, then he's already at an advantage. Okay, Fargo is amassing a lot of Gatling tanks. No chain gun upgrade yet. Certainly in this matchup, the chain gun upgrade uh, is certainly worth the investment. Makes the Gatling tanks plus 25% damage, which is huge. Very good. Against, uh, against the Air Force. And oh, might lose one here. Might lose one. Yes, he does. Oh, might lose another one here. Oh, Vivid also here with a bad micromanagement. What is this? Fargo and Vivid unable to micromanage their Humvees properly. Both players lost their first two Humvees. And maybe the Vivid... Oh, the same! Oh, but he survived a little bit longer. It was 3 minutes 20. Oh, so Fargo actually better Air Force than the Vivid by 7 seconds. Six, six, no, 4 seconds. 4 seconds. Oh, Fargo a little bit better, but <laughs> still lost. Oh, okay, so Fargo 2 and Vivid 2. What is this? What is this? Oh, if you cannot micro Humvees, why? Why play so risky? I don't understand. Oh, the Vivid and the Fargo. But it's quite amusing. Maybe they chatted too much. Maybe they typed the easy GG, well played, fuck you. Yeah, maybe they did this and then they screwed up the micro. Could be. Ah, oh. ah, oh. okay. We are going quick, guys. Let's take a look at the chat. What is happening in the chat? Let's see. Let's see the reactions here. Oh, it's still scrolling. The text is still... Uh, it's refreshing. It takes a while. YouTube is very slow here. Let's take a look. Yeah, tank is overpowered, certainly. The little black cat says it all. What is this? <laughs> what is it? Ah. Uh, yeah. Let's see. Uh, okay. GG, well played, fuck you. Exactly. Okay, now that was match number four. Oh, we are just <laughs> we are just 23 minutes <laughs> into the stream and we all <laughs> we already saw four matches. Wow. Okay, it's really it's really fast. Maybe we should watch a movie to just have a regular streaming time here yeah, of like 2-3 hours. Uh, because this might be just under 30 minutes yeah, if we keep going like this. Ah, the Vivid and the Fargo. Maybe they just hate long matches. Yeah, Long matches are boring. So they will go with this. Okay, now we got the, uh, the, um, the delay. Let's put in the delay music again. So it's uh, Vivid with, what was it? Toxin. Vivid Toxin. And Fargo with the Demolition. Uh -huh. Okay. This map is big. There is a nice village with a church. Mm -hmm. Looks good. Couple of supply piles here. And there's one oil derrick here. And two oil derricks here. Uh -huh. Fargo already goes there with his workers. And so does a Vivid with one of his lousy workers. Yeah. One worker certainly not as good as two workers. And a terrorist is coming as well. Those players also go to the village. And not sure if it's a proper placement here for the tunnel. I think building the tunnel closer to the buildings would be much better. Yeah, because then the tunnel, the toxin tunnel, can clear those houses. Yeah, if you put it here or here in the center. <laughs> Yeah, if you put it in the center, it can clear four houses. Yeah, easy. Very easy. 
But okay, it is what it is. Well, if the Vivid likes to build there, I won't argue with him. He can do whatever he wants. It's his game. Uh, his workers. Okay. So, the terrorist killed his worker here. Did uh, force uh, the cancel. And Fargo secures the oil for now. And prepares the Tech Terror. <laughs> uh, it's coming in hot here. Crushes a bunch of trees. And the Vivid has two uh, technicals here for the defense. Might be able to intercept it. Maybe not. Oh, actually, yeah, it's driving. Oh, should be able to intercept it. Oh, there's a terrorist. <gasps> wow, humongous blow here. Wow, Fargo, well done. Killed uh, all these technicals, RPGs, and the supply. Supply did survive, though. We rebuild. Uh, there you see this guy in the hole. He will. He <laughs> just crawl out and repair. Yeah. Oh, very well done there by the Fargo. Okay. It's a best of 13. So the first player to win 7 matches goes to the final of the Gold Cup. Against either Size or X Cup. They will play on Monday. Okay, Fargo has more reinforcements. Nice. Does kill one more Toyota. Still a good amount of units here for the Vivid. Should be able to defend. But may lose a couple of stuff here as well. Fargo does have a worker here. But the question is, can he defend the worker long enough to finish the tunnel? That's a question. Uh, maybe not. Maybe not. Jeeps are already coming. And the Fargo is not shooting on there. Oh, does protect this worker for now. The worker keeps building. Oh, nice uh, run over there. But loses his technical. And oh, the worker at 95%. Very bad luck there for the Fargo. Almost done. Oh, good defense here by the Vivid. But, oh, the Fargo, <laughs> very sneaky here. Built a tunnel here and it's building a tunnel right next to the Armzilla. Oh, I cannot believe. I cannot believe. Okay, that, that, that is outrageous. That is out. And Fargo is a magician. Oh. Oh, that, oh, I cannot believe. I cannot believe. This is carnage. Fargo is the ownage. Oh, that is total domination. The Vivid takes quite some face slap here. The bitch slap. Oh, oh, oh. He does have a super technical though. Maybe he can turn around the tide here with the super. Toyota. But he's excellent micro for this. But keep in mind it's very strong. Takes out units in no time. But the Fargo is still in a very good position here. Has close access to the main supply. With it no arms dealer right now. Just a fake one. Does have just one super technical. Needs to make a good use of it. Does have another supply here though. But so does a Fargo. Nice run over there. Kills all the workers there with one technical. And this tunnel is still in good position. Builds another one. Oh, probably typing easy GG in the chat right now. <laughs> ah, Fargo, very professional. What about the oils? No capture yet. But still has this for himself. Okay, Vivid in a little bit of trouble here. What am I saying? Not just a little bit. A lot. Vivid in a lot of trouble. Another tunnel being built here by very ambitious workers. <laughs> ah, powerful. Okay, but good, um, good aggression here by the Vivid. We'll clear this. But there's one more tunnel here for the Fargo. If he wants, he can, to, can pop something there. Yeah. He does. Maybe a bunch of battle buses. Or well, demo bikes. I have to say, this uh, Jeep is well micro here by the Vivid. He does make good use of it. Okay, and I'm happy to see that this match is already longer than all the other ones. Yeah, we are at 6 minutes. And it uh, looks good. Looks like this will be a proper match. Yeah, no fast bash. No easy GG. 
This is a proper zero hour man. Oh, the explosion killed the worker here. And once again, the workers will be crushed. Well done here. Boy, the Fargo goes in, goes out, kills a lot. Ah, but with it, uh, considering the circumstance, he does well. Good defense. Get a very bad start. Actually, he's still in a very bad spot, I have to say. If he comes back from this, it <laughs> will be quite, uh, quite good for him. But it's hard. Very hard. Fargo in a very good position. Does have the oil directs. Still has his oil down here. May lose it though. Okay. Question is, can the Vivid come back from this? Fargo, keep in mind, he has two oils. Why is he not capturing this one? Fargo, that's another oil. Take it. I don't understand. Okay, he does clear the house here. Could also send the Toxin Tractor to spray here on the ground. Looks like he doesn't do that. He does, he does, he does. Yeah, this is very good here. Yeah, can spray. Very nice, very nice. Okay, meantime, the Vivid will harass oil directs here. Maybe, oh, terrorist? No, no terrorist. Yeah, this super technical is still alive. Is still oh, he killed, he killed his own super technical with his RPGs. Maybe a little bit too ambitious there, the Vivid. Yeah, his RPGs are too powerful. But okay, if he can kill the oil, good for him. But still, unfortunate to lose, to lose his super technical. Ah, oh, I cannot believe. Okay, we got a demo bikes. Demo upgrade, not research yet. And he has another super attaching. Fully scrap. Well done. Should be able to kill the oil. Meantime, we have another jeep coming in here. And oh, we'll kill the arms dealer entirely and kill all these workers. Well done here by the Fargo. Does lose his oil, but the revenge does not take long. Fargo on top of this match. And finally, also capturing the oil in the center. Well done there. Uh, Fargo does well, but vivid considering the circumstances also does well. But still takes quite a beating here. And the uh, toxin tractor down here. Needs to clear the toxin shit. Okay. Now, Fargo's base. Ooh, wow, very nice. Already building those black markets. <laughs> Fargo becoming rich. Okay, maybe this one will be intercepted. Yes, it will be. Well done here by the Vivid. And Fargo suicides his terrorist. I think that's the best thing to do there because you don't want to give the opponent some XP for killing the terrorist. Oh, the Super Technical being taken out by overpowered demo bikes. And maybe this oil will go down as well. Unless there is a toxin tractor in the tunnel. Okay, Vivid is still alive. Maybe this one needs a repair. Another technical is coming. Yeah, Vivid. Vivid pretty much just plays out of defense right now. That's that, that, that's that's a job. Yeah. And the Fargo tries to find a way inside to kill another arms dealer. Uh -huh. Yeah, the Vivid really doesn't have all that much. A couple of tunnels. Three supplies, arms dealer, that's it. And Fargo keeps wasting his technicals. <laughs> okay, Vivid now, with a worker here, maybe he gets into the base of the Fargo to establish some tunnel. Uh -huh. Okay, Vivid. Ah. Yes, quite a number of units, but if the Fargo has some lousy demo bikes, should be able to take out all these tanks. Yeah, one, two, three tanks here and everything is gone. What is this? There's a demo trap, okay. And there's a German girl. Oh, 
Oh, the toxin tunnel. We'll kill the German. <laughs> well done there. And another Tesh Terror has been intercepted. Okay, now actually the Vivid is fighting his way back into the match here. It looked like he was dead at the start. But he's okay now. For now. Oh. The overpowered demo bike is just casually driving behind the tanks. Scorpion rocket kills the demo bike. And the demo bike says, thank you. I will take a couple of guys with me. <laughs> okay, this tunnel did go up. But it's been killed very quickly. No problem here for the Fargo. And yeah, the poor Vivid now has to face all these demo bikes. But good progress here in the center. Maybe able to knock out the Fargo from this place. And needs to be careful about the workers. They can go for a suicide here. Yeah, workers are deadly. And the German is there as well. Uh, just like this, Vivid loses his attack. What a huge explosion! This church was <laughs> was jacked with explosions, apparently. Oh, wow! Okay, yeah, very good harassment here by the by the vivid, but also strong worker killed two scorpions there. Well done. Okay, let's take a look at the base. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Six markets. Six and a half. Ah, Fargo in a good position. Vivid with one market. Two markets. Oh. Certainly. Fargo is still ahead. Also, this is almost mined out. Not too much left here. So, yeah, the market count certainly matters at this point. Actually, there's not all that much money on this map. Yeah, the oils are relatively easy to kill. And what is this? What is oh I cannot I cannot scroll to it. But this is um the fountain of youth. Oh wow, nice. What is this here? Oh very ambitious worker. <laughs> Where did you want to go there? Want to build a tunnel here, maybe. Yeah, that doesn't work. It doesn't work like this. Okay, Fargo. Is with a demo bike behind here. Is scouting. I jump and kill on the bike. Nice snipe. Very nice. Does have the cash bounty. Over hundred dollar for sniping. Some lousy demo bike. Only ten dollar for killing a worker. Huh? What is this? A rebel on the bike. Okay. Let's see where this is heading to. Ah. Uh -huh. Triggers the demo bike. Uh -huh. And dies. Well done there. Good job. Meantime. Oh, the Fargo does have a good army here. A lot of demo bikes. Two battle buses. Well done. Should be able to clear those tunnels here. German Kel is here and also a couple of scorpions. And oh nice rebel ambush. Kills a German and the tanks. Well done here by the Fargo. Now the question is can he go with the battle buses into the base and kill those markets? Maybe he can. Yes. Oh this might be game over here. If the Vivid cannot stop this. And that is a GG. 16 minutes. Oh that was the first proper match here. <laughs> Between the Vivid and the Fargo. I think Fargo from the start, very confident. Performance did very well. Vivid was hanging on. I'm surprised he did survive for as long as he did. But he was certainly in a disadvantage very, very early. Okay, that was match number five. Let's go to match number six. <laughs> okay, that would be the rematch. Vivid versus Fargo. Now, Vivid with uh, demolition. Green color at the top and the Fargo blue color toxin at the bottom.
Uh, it's a nice map. Maybe it's a little bit uh, large and wide open. Yeah, there's you can't you cannot really defend. Yeah, the technicals they can go everywhere. You can't bunker in. Yeah, maybe here you can. Oh, one tunnel is good here for defense. Yeah, but you cannot bunker here. It's too open. It's very open. Let's see what's here. No. Mm -hmm. Oh, very nice. Looks like Italy. Beautiful. Very nice. Oh, it says something here. Hotel. Schiff. It's a German town. Oh, Fargo killed his own worker there. Looks like it. Yeah, the blue worker was here. <laughs> the blue terrorist killed his own worker. Friendly fire. Okay, so Fargo does have a tunnel there, and the Vivid does as well. And the Vivid does secure the oils here for now. And the Fargo. Probably waits for the technical and there it is. Vivid is coming in. Maybe we kill the war factory. Or the barracks. Ah, he wants to kill the barracks. And now the workers. And there are four more terrorists. Oh, this could be huge! Oh, 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 oh that was outrageous by the Vivid. Wow, killed all the buildings. There's nothing left. I think Fargo can write now in the chat. GG easy. I think so. Wow, that was very professional here by the Vivid. Good start. Fargo. Oh, only has one supply. And the Vivid is relentless. Does send more technicals here. Fargo wants to rebuild. But Vivid says no. You don't get to. <laughs> Does force a cancer. Okay, now Fargo, he's not too happy about it. Does send a couple of jeeps off his own. And okay, does kill this. No. Ah, he wants to camp in front of the war factory. Yeah, good idea. Might be able to take it out. Yeah. But the Vivid is there. Yeah, this is a good fight. And with a toxin tractor. Oh, that is very good for the Vivid. Clears all these units here. That is a GG. Oh, again, under four minutes. Oh, that was a very fast audit here by the Vivid. No chance for the Fargo. Oh, 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 oh. oh Vivid 3 and the Fargo 3. Oh, we're not even 45 minutes into the game. <laughs> it is already 3-3. Three, three. Six matches have been completed. I have to say, these guys... <laughs> then they make it quick. Ah, oh, okay. Let's take a look if everything is still working well here. Yeah, this looks good. Fargo just give up. Yeah. GG easy. Yeah, certainly. I did not expect that the matches would be so quick here between those. I thought that they would have some long bunker games. Especially with the GLA. Usually you expect... Long bunker match with the GLA, yeah? Usually players are uh, streamers. There are some streamers. Like I know the CNCHD, for example. He's very upset whenever there's a GLA mirror. It does not matter what happens in the GLA mirror. He always doesn't like it. Yeah, the, it could be the most exciting GLA fight ever in the history of Zero Hour. But some streamers are like, uh, I'm not having this. I don't like this. This is GLA. It's boring. It takes too long. The, the jeeps are not fast enough. The workers are collecting slow. I don't like this. I want to see the China and the USA. Yeah. And I, I'm, I'm always scratching my head because Dr. Thrax, Jundis, and, and, and the Prince Kazakh, they're the finest gentlemen here in the game. I don't understand why you could hate on them. Such haters. <laughs> okay, now, next match. We got. Vivid with the Super Weapon General versus Fargo with the USA. Ah, with the USA. There it is. 
Okay, the map is sent up and let's switch to the USA music. Oh, I was wrong. USA music. There we go. Okay, so the Fargo here in the blue color on the right side. A bit, bit green color on the left side with a super weapon. General, yeah, the Humvees are more expensive. Um, $850 versus $700 for the Humvee for the USA. Yeah, much cheaper. $150 price difference. Certainly makes a... Make some, make some difference, certainly. But maybe the Vivid can bunker in here. Yeah, EMP Patriot. EMP Patriot. And EMP Patriot. Yeah, three Patriots bunker in. And then defend, like the devil. Get the Alpha Auroras, the super weapons. Oh, I, I've never seen it. I've never seen a USA bunker here in the extra of guns. Uh, usually it's just Humvee fights. Yeah, laser locks, Humvees. Never bunker. Oh, this is a critical moment here for the Vivid. Needs to crush those guys. Nice laser up there. Oh, kills it. Those are and the Humvee. Well done here by the Fargo. Also, fast laser lock here on the Chinook. Does have the dozer there. Maybe he can build a fire base or oh, a oh, Patriot. Actually, a fire base makes sense. Yep, drop it here. Oh, the barracks also is good. Okay, meantime, the uh, Vivid does capture two oil directs, three oil directs. Okay, good for the Vivid, but he needs it. He needs the cash because right now he cannot collect. Does send one rocket dude for the laser lock. And those are still on the base. Fargo will stop one oil capture. Well done there. And Vivid now on two oil directs. Fargo, good collection. Will capture one oil direct here. Is still in the base. We need a laser lock. And Fargo does, but Vivid kills it anyway. Okay, Fargo does have two Humvees out. Yeah. And the those are still alive. Could build something in the base. Maybe a war factory here. Okay, this Humvee is very hurt. Needs a repair. And this dozer is still alive. Wow, super dozer. Looks like uh, the Vivid does not care about this. Yeah, let it live. Okay, now the Vivid finally entering the base of the Fargo. But not for too long. Wants to go here up on the top and capture the oil. Fargo right now on three oil directs. Vivid on two. Fargo certainly in an advantage. Also has three Chinooks. Vivid has two. The Vivid now goes for the oil capture here. Okay, now the Fargo also entering the premise here of the Vivid. I don't think that the Vivid is having this. No. We'll go here, try to laser lock. Meantime, Vivid does capture the oil directs. Well done here. Does have three right now, but the Fargo will have three very soon again as well. Okay, I think Vivid needs to recapture this one. Close to his home base. Couple of armies down here. Nothing too serious. And the Fargo now has three oils. Okay, Fargo does have the Tau missile upgrade. Good uh, choice. Yeah, the Tau missile is always worth the investment. $800, very cheap. Makes all the Humvees much, much better. Okay, the Fargo. It looks like both players really enjoy capturing those oils back and forth. They want to get the oil. And they should. This is Capture Wars. Command and Conquer. Generous Capture Wars.
Okay, Fargo has a respectable amount of hummies here. Seven. No ambulance. Looks like no player is interested in those two, su two supply piles here. 60,000 dollars altogether. No one is interested. Okay, search and destroy. Strategy center for the Vivid. But Fargo is not interested. He has a strategy center of his own. Both players plus 20% range. And Fargo is moving right at the back of the base. And this could be the decider. Yeah, critical moment here for the Vivid. He needs to de knock these out somehow. But how? Well positioned here behind the supply. Oh, this is so annoying. What now? Vivid cannot collect. And the Fargo is playing cat and mouse here. Yeah. Vivid lost the army. Nice laser lock there. Oh, very good position here for the Fargo. Does kill all the Humvees here. Losers almost none. Well done here by the Fargo. This could be the GG. Oh, the Vivid takes a massive beating. Also, the Fargo has whole map. All the, all the oils. And there is a GG. Very well done here by the Fargo. Oh, okay. But at least it was longer than the G lane mirror. But still, a rather quick match. Okay, Fargo 4. Oops, put it in 2. Yeah, 4. And Vivid 3. Okay. Oh, that was a quick match still. But longer than the usual. Well done there. Okay, that was match number 7. Let's go for match number 8. The rematch. Okay, now Vivid, green color, USA on the right side. And Fargo, blue color, super weapon on the left side. Uh, this map, five oil directs, certainly makes sense to capture with the USA. And uh, typically these matches always go the same. Yeah, players try to capture the oil or they kill the oil. And then they go into the main base and then it's GG. Yeah. It's very rarely that players go for this and fight long for this. There's no big fights around this town here. No one captures this one. Yeah. Maybe, maybe a Patriot drop would be nice. Yeah. EMP Patriot drop. Drop it right here. Or here. Yeah. Perfect spot. If it works, it works, right? <laughs> Okay, Vivid. Oh, that could be a big drop. Yeah, three rocket soldiers and the dozer in the chino. Let's take a look. Oh, it's going in strong. I oh, should be able to kill this dozer. Well done. And Fargo will drop his one. Okay, one Chinook down here for the Fargo. Did not pull it away. Doza is still alive. And the Vivid pulls his Chinooks away. Okay, Fargo. Fargo is in and the Vivid is in. What now? Most players cannot uh, <laughs> collect here. Nice laser lock there. We'll kill it. The Bad Ranger is here. Should kill it. And Vivid can collect. And his main base, once again. Meantime, Vivid is still here. Fargo cannot collect right now, but... We'll try to capture the oil here. And there. Uh, Fargo, no cash right now. He has $250 on the bank. Actually, he did drop money there. Yeah, he can collect in the center. That's okay. Ah, nice radar like there. From both sides. Does kill the Doza and the Rangers come in. Well done here by the Vivid. Deals about this situation. For now. Okay, and Fargo is still <laughs> stealing cash. Maybe a little bit too ambitious. A Humvee is there. But Fargo notices and pulls it away. Well done there. Yeah. Instead, he can either collect here from the center. Or now in his home base. Okay, Fargo on two oil directs. Four oil directs. Three oil directs. Uh, okay, he's back in action. He has another Chinook here. I wonder if you forgot about it. He's not collecting right now. Meantime, Vivid on two Chinooks. No oils. 
I think far go ahead. Yeah. Maybe use this as well here. The channel. Why not? It's there. Use it. Okay, Vivid does have three Humvees. Fargo has none. This War Factory is here. Very, very much forward. Actually, this is very risky because if all the Humvees go here, then Fargo has to surrender this. Okay, but the Vivid goes into the main base here. Oh, good for the Vivid. Might be able to kill everything. But also Fargo has a plenty of missile defenders for the laser lock. Good for him. Yeah, now Vivid is coming with all his forces here. Fargo in trouble. He might lose his base here. Yeah. Uh, the production is camped and the vivid can kill it well done there and there is a gg very fast just over four minutes or oh. these guys they are taking no prisoners it's only a hard bash that's that's all they know vivid versus fargo very short matches what is this this is so far the quickest set in this tournament unbelievable unbelievable i i i su i suspect that the Vivid vs Fargo will be the exact opposite of a size vs Excal. Excal size, they are known for taking it slow. Yeah, they take the time. If they are if they are under pressure, they first make sure that their base is safe. Yeah? They don't go all in. They don't do this. They go for proper stable tactics. Yeah? The long term reliable ownage. Yeah? Long term build up and then big bash. But the Vivid and Fargo, they they like the risk. <laughs> they go all in for the hard rush. And that also means quick win. Okay. That was uh, four for Vivid and four for Fargo. Okay. Now let's go for match number nine. We are not even <laughs> one hour into the event. And this is already the ninth match. Okay. Now we got Fargo with a laser versus a Vivid with a demolition. Let's lock it in. Laser versus demolition. Okay. Both players still need three more wins. First player with seven goes to the final against either size or the X car. Okay. Well, this is a nice map. I like this. There's oil derricks here on the side. And uh, birds in the center, supply piles. And some dogs. What is this here? A truck. A chicken truck. There's a chicken head on top. Isn't it? Looks like a chicken. Ah, probably. Okay, the vivid is for building a tunnel. And there. And uh, Fargo with the USA. Two supplies. Uh, how much uh, supply piles? 30,000. And. Oh, 45,000 on this one. Oh, a lot, a lot. Okay. This is a proper cash map. Uh, a good uh, start here by Vivid putting his rocket soldiers into the houses. You can do the same here. Put one there, one here. It's very powerful. Okay, Fargo a little bit more defensive here. But I like this. This looks good. Maybe this match will take longer than five minutes. Yeah, with a defense like this, means he will survive a little bit longer. Maybe, maybe. Unless a Vivid has a lot of explosive on board. Oh, this firebase won't live long. Uh, goes down. Did not even shoot once. And this dozer goes down as well. Oh, this might be another quick match here. Oh, there's a... Oh, terrorist kills a Ravi. Well done here by the Vivid. Oh, and also kills a dozer. And can get the scrap. Oh, and now he has a fully scrap technical. No upgrade though. And no veterancy. So I need to kill a couple of units first. 
Okay. A uh, good start for the Vivid. Killed uh, quite a number of units. And interesting. The Dozer builds this firebase over the corner. Very powerful Dozer. Telepathic. <laughs> okay, Fargo might be in trouble here on the supply. Yeah. Might lose it actually. And the other station is coming in as well. Oh, nice laser lock here by the Fargo. Might be able to kill a lot. No, the Vivid is retreating for now. His worker is doing a good job here. He's building the tunnel. And the supply went down. Well done here by the Vivid. Very strong aggression. This tunnel may go up. Maybe. Maybe not. Actually, it may not. Worker is in danger. But it's still working hard. Oh, actually, this might go up. Oh, 98%. Very close call there. Fargo really likes to make it uh, <laughs> entertaining. And oh, there was a kill. The supply was killed. Forced the cell of the war factory. Well done there by the Vivid. Oh, sniper precision. <laughs> well done. Killed both supplies there. And those Humvees. Oh. Well done here, Vivid. Superior micro. And he does have two strong tacticals. One is super dead. It's a GG. Once again, just over four minutes. Oh, what is this? Oh, what, oh, what is this? Vivid and Fargo. Such a strong, efficient play. Eh, Vivid, a very, uh, there's not much that Fargo could do there. Eh, he lost all his units, <laughs> all his buildings, his supplies. And of course, that means he takes a beating. Oh, Vivid needs two more wins. And by the looks of it, <laughs> by the looks of it, this, <laughs> this match will be over in uh, 10 minutes. Yeah, I think in 10 minutes we will know the winner. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, maybe you can maybe you expected a nice long evening, yeah, with the Stanislav. And with the Vivid and the Fargo, yeah. Big action. Maybe you leave this evening disappointed with very short action. Oh, I'm sorry about this. But what what can Stanislav do? I can't I can't tell the players to play longer. Yeah, if I was a streamer now and they were playing and I was observing, I would tell, hey, Vivid and Fargo. Vivid, listen, please, let the Fargo live a little, little bit longer, yeah, and Fargo, maybe bunker a little bit more so you survive longer, yeah, the same actually for the Vivid, so that they can increase the match length a little bit, yeah, because the viewers, they also want to see a little bit of action here for their money, yeah, everyone play the entrance tickets, and the matches are so short. Yeah, it's like it's like watching a football match. Yeah, you go to the stadium, you watch Barcelona versus Real Madrid. Yeah, you watch, and the match only takes ten minutes, and then everyone is injured. Yeah, big fouls, red cards, all the players sent off, and you will go home disappointed. You wanted to see ninety minutes, you get ten minutes, not fair. Need a reimbursement, right? Not nice. And so I think. I think Fargo and Vivid, they should not own that hard and quick. Maybe take it a little bit slower. Change from 7th gear to 6th gear. Yeah, it's still fast enough. Yeah, Deutscher Autobahn, yeah, you go with 300 kilometers per hour. Yeah, it's fast enough. No need here to go with Mach 2. Yeah, no need. Fargo and Vivid, way too powerful. Okay. Nice worker hunt. Does kill it before it enters a house. Vivid. Now, he can show us how to survive here with <laughs> USA against the demolition. Unless uh, Fargo also manages to blow up everything here, he's already coming in hot with his technique. Oh, but this might get intercepted. Actually, it survives. Oh, just in time. One more rocket and probably would be dead. Ah, Fargo, master of survival. Okay. We'll try to attack from here. But Vivid builds a nice firebase. I like this. I like this. Fargo's coming in. We'll kill the firebase. Oh, that sounded painful. But Vivid doesn't care. Just rebuilds it. Well done there. Yeah, safety first. Always drop the firebase. 
This match is this shot. You need a little bit of defense. Okay. Very, very professional defense here by the Vivid. Stops every attack so far. Just lost the Firebase, but who cares? Firebase is just a $1,000. Quick to rebuild. But Fargo has more. Maybe we'll kill the power. Or the supply here. Or the dozer. Or everything. Let's see. What's inside? Ah, it's not all that much. I think the Humvees are much better. They should be able to clear everything up without losing all that much. Ah, good micromanagement here by the Vivid. Lost nothing. Kill two jeeps here. Well done. Well done there. Good defense. This worker oh, is out of position. Can be killed. Ah, needs to go back. Well done there by the Fargo. Ambulance is here. Nice laser. I have to say, Vivid, much uh, more professional. Use a play here. Will stop the Fargo's attack. Well done there. Yeah. Well done. And this worker takes a beating as well. Yeah, so far, Vivid lost no major building. Only a bunch of armies and a firebase. But Fargo is relentless. He does add more. Yeah, probably terrorists inside here. Maybe gets one now. Yes, yes. Very nice. Well done there by the Fargo. Maybe can also kill this uh, Dozer. Yes, kills the Dozer with one more terrorist inside. Well done there. By the fuck, what's the last dozer? No, there's another one. Puts it into the chino. Vivid down to one dozer, but has a big army here. Six Humvees, one ambulance, Hellfire drones. Needs to get the Tau missile upgrade for the Humvees. Nice. Also, drive by, kills the scaffold. Well done there. By the Vivid. Goes here for the main base. Fargo may take a beating here if he's unable to stop this attack. Nice. Vivid going in strong, kills two technicals. Will kill the scaffold, maybe kill this tunnel and then the arms dealer. Or the arms dealer first. Yeah, Fargo in trouble. Does also go in. Oh, might actually kill this. Oh no, the firebase stopped it. Oh, he did not get through. And that's why you built a firebase. It's powerful. Very, very strong. Good attack here by the Vivid. And also excellent defense. I think Sides and uh, Sir Excal would be proud to see the bunkerage of the Vivid. Very nice. Then there is a GG. Just under 6 minutes. Another quick match, but not as quick as the previous one. Oh, Vivid goes in the lead here with 6 to 4. Oh, just one more win here for the Vivid. And he will be in the final. One more victory. Okay, let's take a look at the chat. If the, if the viewers go mental, Vivid Superior. Expert Terror Tesh. Yeah. Let's GG. Beautiful. Oh, Mr. Gyabol, is this a is this a critique here? A very weird professional streamer. I'm not sure. Is that a, is that a, is that a compliment? Or is that a rose? Either way, I appreciate your input, Mr. Gabon. Always much appreciated. Well done there. Okay, so that was match number 10. Yeah, match number 10. We are ready for match number 11. Ah, uh, beautiful. Good progress so far. <laughs> it's just one hour, 10 minutes into the stream. <laughs> and it's almost over. If... If the Vivid wins the next one, oh, this could be the quickest semi-final ever. Yeah, last year, Vivid vs. Boyka was one of the longest. Took 4 hours or so. But Vivid vs. Fargo, very fast and efficient. Okay, we got uh, Vivid with the Demolition once again. Against Fargo with the Stealth. Okay, let's lock it in. Let's switch to the GLA music. Ah, much more fitting here in this matchup. And oh, I have uh, I have my suspicion here already. I suspect this will be a three-minute game. <laughs> I think so. Yeah, because uh, I suspect Vivid will once once again build a big attached terror, send it in, 
and kill the arms dealer and then come with a couple more testicles and then the Fargo will surrender. I think so. I think so. Unless a Fargo can bunk up well here with a Prince Kazad and defend against a terror action from the Vivid. We will see. Vivid already coming in here with his terrorist on this work. I might be able to get it. Mid time. Oh, this one could also be stopped. Vivid preparing well here. Okay, do terrorists cancel each other there? Okay. And the Fargo. Uh, looks like those tunnels will go up, but if the Vivid gets in here, he will have the house and can kill this tunnel here from the house. Yeah, the range should be sufficient. I think so. Yeah. I think if he clicks on there, he can hit it. Yeah. Okay, Vivid also gets this house. Oh, both bunkers in range. Oh, very bad here for the Fargo. What about this worker? Yeah, it's quite ambitious. Maybe we can do something there. What about the technicals? There it is. There is a deadly technical coming for the Fargo. Oh, Fargo needs to prepare himself here. For very dangerous technical. But the Fargo also has one attack incoming. Let's take a look. What is he up to? Okay, this goes for the crash. And this goes for the kill. Will kill the supply. Well done. Also kills the tunnel. Well done here by the Vivid. Meantime, he just lost a couple of workers here. Not too shabby. Fargo going in here with a worker. This technical will leave the base. Job is done. Go back to home. Meantime, Fargo does crash a respectable amount of workers. Well done there. Uh, and also kills the technical. Okay, but overall, I think much better start here for the Vivid. Also kills more technicals here. Fargo in trouble. I think so. Rebuild his main supply. Ah, Vivid is dangerous. With the delay, he's not messing around. Always goes with a very strong technical at the start. And he has three of them right now. Uh, Fargo already knows what's up. He knows death is incoming. The technicals of death. Uh, can he stop this? Oh, nice attach RPG here. But also... Oh, nice terrorist there. Blows up the rocket man. Well done there by the Fargo. But Vivid is quick here to intercept the worker. Before it can finish the turn. Nice. Well done. Good harassment here by the Vivid. Fargo in trouble. A lot of trouble. Oh, I wonder. I wonder if he has his fingers on the keyboard to write the easy GG here. But I don't think so. I don't think so. Doesn't look too good for the Fargo. David now has three supplies. He has good bunkers in the center. Fargo needs to dig himself out of this hole. He cannot afford to lose. He needs to win three matches in a row now. Otherwise, he's out. And Vivid is coming once again with a superior amount of Toyota technicals. Forces to sell of the fake barracks. Maybe he should have uh, suicided it instead. No? Just uh, exploded. A little bit of a stand of situation here. Most players don't know what to do. Well, actually, Vivid looks like he knows what he's doing. He puts a pressure where it hurts. Oh, nice interception there. Fargo wanted to get into the bunker. But Vivid is not having this. No. We'll kill it. Well done. Okay, Vivid also building a tunnel network here near the base of the Fargo. And actually, this is an excellent tunnel. Will have very good access to the main base. 
Still going strong. Vivid is going strong here. Oh, this could be a Fargo pop. <laughs> Almost. Just loses one quad. Trademark Fargo pop. Now we didn't see any original one here in the set. But maybe he's working on it. Okay. Fargo does have a hijacker. Yeah, and I cannot believe here the clock. We are way above six minutes. Wow. How did this happen? No, we are not. There's a GG. I cannot believe. Oh. It's official, guys. Seven for the Vivid and four for the Fargo. Congratulations, Mr. Vivid. You're going to the Gold Cup final. Very solid performance against the Fargo. Quick matches. Under one hour, 20 minutes, this stream, and we <laughs> the result is concluded. Congratulations. Yeah, Vivid uh, knocked out the Boyka with a 7-5, and the Fargo with a 7-4 goes to the final. Let's take a look at the tournament grid. Yeah, there it is. Vivid going here to the final. We'll either meet the size or the x car and the Fargo going here. For the third place match against one of those. So Fargo still has a chance to get hands on $200. But Vivid, $400 are safe for him. Yeah, at least $400 for him. And $800 if he wins the final. Uh, very solid performance by the Vivid. There was no doubt that he would knock out the Fargo with strong rush like this. And the Fargo, yeah, good fight. But not enough today. Alright guys, that was a very short, uh, very short evening. By the looks of it. Yeah, let's take a look here. Check Discord please. Check Discord. Huh? Yeah, I will check later. Uh, tomorrow, tomorrow we will stream. What will we stream? Yeah, tomorrow, Roll versus Herb. Silver Cup, semi-final. At 20 GMT, same time as today, Mr. Roll versus Herb. They did play today. Streamer was SPL. And uh, yeah, you can either watch on the SPL the video, a Russian streamer, or tomorrow here, the replays would be good. I think so. Yeah, and then on Monday, of course, very exciting match here. Size versus Excal, the last semi final in this competition, in the Gold Cup. Stream by Mr. Anti Pro. That should be most excellent. Very exciting. Yeah. Probably the two best players all time. And of course, should be very exciting. And Stanislav will cover this replays of this on Tuesday. Tuesday, 20 GMT. We'll cover this as well. Yeah. So you, you won't miss a beat here on this channel. But of course, you can also watch the original streams. From the other guys here. yeah, From the anti-pro. SPL. They all got you covered. Okay guys. I think that's about it. There's nothing else to say. I think. Yeah. Let's take a look in the chat. What is happening here? Mr. Gerbol. I really appreciate your new comment. Very smart professional streamer. Thank you very much. That's not a roast. Definitely not. Yeah. yeah. Uh, it's a stream tomorrow. Yes. As I said. There will be. Herb versus uh, Roll. And uh, yeah, size versus x -Cal. Definitely should be a very good match. Little Black Cat says it all. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, 70 minutes for the best of 13. That was very, very quick. Uh, probably one of the quickest semi finals ever. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed and I wish you a great day or a great night, great morning or a great evening, wherever you are. And I'll see you next time at the Stanislav TV. Goodbye.
Thank you.